Well, our first guest is best known for playing opposite Ben Stiller and the late Robin Williams in the Night at the Museum franchise. Yeah, we're very excited to have her here in studio. You may recognize her as Sacagawea, <laughs> but we know her as actress Mieswo Peck. How are you, Mieswo? Hey, I'm great. How are you doing? Thank Very you for well. being here. Yes, thank you for me. So you have some Connecticut ties. Um, I do, yes. My father is from Hamden, Connecticut. So, woo-hoo! Yeah. <laughs> oh, like that. Yeah. So, so tell us a little bit about your acting career. You, you have yeah. quite the resume. Um, well, I started early at 11. I was singing and dancing and doing musical theater at this uh, theater that's still around called Tada, this um, youth theater program. I actually just went to go see their, their show. I love to support them. Um, they're really, really awesome. And uh, yeah, I've been born and raised New Yorker and I've just been auditioning and doing theater and commercials and you know, modeling and voiceovers and stuff for basically my entire life. <laughs> uh, well, it's, it's good that you're doing something that you enjoy, and, and you're most well known for the Night at the Museum franchise. Tell yes. us about your experience there, and of course, working with the late and great Robin Williams. Yeah, I mean, getting Night at the Museum was like a dream come true, right? I mean, an actor's dream, especially this kind of movie with this kind of cast and uh, the sets and the costumes, and just it was just wild and, and you know, just incredible um, and you know Robin and I worked together for three films and and he was just such a an amazing kind generous um, beautiful Teddy Roosevelt my boyfriend yeah I mean I just can't believe he's gone and um, I just feel so lucky that I was able to work with him and and in this last film, we were walking arm in arm through the museum, and we just had a lot of nice, you know, quiet moments oh, together. Nice. So it was really sweet. What's yeah. What's one thing about Robin that that you picked up on that most people wouldn't know? I mean, he's not always on. That's for <laughs> sure. You know, I mean, he definitely can hold the crowd, and he's a genius. And whatever you you know come up with, he'll riff off it. And I remember the first movie, I was like just standing around and and shaking my costume that had lots of beads on it, and he just started this rap song, like, oh. about, you know, whatever, about everything. So you guys are freestyling. Yeah, yeah, he's, he's, he can freestyle anything. I mean, that's wow. a really great way to put it. Like, he can just riff on anything. Um, but, you know, he's also just a regular, cool, down-to-earth guy, so he's not always Mr. Comedy, you know. Sure. And, yeah. and talking about somebody else who's Mr. Comedy, Ben Stiller, you also work yeah, with him. Yeah, he's super cool as well. Um, workaholic, um, and just really... I don't know. I would. I'd like to call him a friend now. You know, at this point, we definitely got to hang a lot in Vancouver, and you know, go out for drinks and stuff. And he's a really great dad, a really great guy, a New Yorker as well. Um, I have to sympathize for him though, because he's very. You know, he's so famous that it's kind of hard sometimes to go out with him without a, a million people coming up yeah. to him and wanting to like chat all the time. All the time right? That's right? What I was yeah, I'm sure. And when I picked <laughs> up at the train station, people yeah. were were just <laughs> jumping Swarming. on our car, yeah, yeah, and I was yeah, like, yeah. please, please. They were pushing stop, me stop. away to get to you. I know you. it was, yeah, it was yeah. rough, but, <laughs> you know, that's, that's but you're, you're taking on a new role as mom. Yeah, I'm how so exciting! Excited. Congratulations. Thank you, and to you too. It's very exciting. This is your first. It's my first. It's a girl. It's oh. coming in August. Oh, nice. Yeah, I'm really, really happy. Do you have a name picked out? Or? Uh, no, my husband and I are just, you know, going through the the lists together. It's, it's kind of tough. It's kind of tough. You have to see the it's baby first. Moment. That's yeah, what Teresa yeah. said. We decided yes. we're going to meet the guy. Right, right. The guy right. Oh, you're having a boy. Oh, That's boy. cute. Yes. Hey, He'll be buddies. Play dates. Yeah, yeah. exactly. You can go to the city, hang out, <laughs> totally. you know. I can be your security guy. I can go <laughs> through and like, hey, keep it away, keep it away. So, so since you both are uh, due, we're going to be playing a game. Uh, it's called Phony or Fact here on CT Style, one of our most popular games here on the show. Well, it's really the first time we've ever played it. But it's pregnancy trivia, so we're going to hook you guys up with your uh, answer okay. Okay. thingies, whatever these are. So I'm going to be asking you some questions about pregnancy trivia, and you either show true or false. Okay, okay. very, uh, very intense game here. Okay, so is this <laughs> phony or fact? You can't pet a cat during your pregnancy. Can I go with false? Yes, I would false. say false, too. You just too. can't clean the litter box. Yes, that's and true. And being that I'm allergic, I don't go near cats anyway. I don't either. Oh. He loves his cat yeah. hunter. He's I a wish big I could cat have a cat. I'm a Leo. Her. My <laughs> daughter's going to be a Leo. I wish I could I'm have a, a cat. Yeah. yeah. But I can't. Leo's, Leo's I'll be Leo's like, you know, sneezing yeah. and crying. Yeah, you don't it just want doesn't it. work. Yeah. Okay, and next dogs up. are better anyway. Dogs are not better. Dogs are not better. Gil Simmons will agree. All right, next up we have walking makes labor go faster. I effect. hope so. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I'm going to go with yeah. True. Well, you are both incorrect, apparently. Uh, how could that 
be incorrect. It helps you feel better, but it doesn't make your labor go I feel like when you're in labor, if you walk, it increases. They say if you exercise a lot, then you can speed it up. But yeah. who, you know, they can't tell. No one can tell. Is that why you were doing calisthetics at the train station? <laughs> yes, exactly. I That's why I walked here from Manhattan. <laughs> <laughs> Just a quick little trip, quick little trip. All right, next question. You shouldn't drink coffee while pregnant. Phony or fact? Well, that's a roundabout answer. Yes. Because you're only supposed to have 200 milligrams of coffee a day, which is two cups. Okay. Nothing more yes. than that. You're allowed to, but I'm just too nervous that I would overdo it like I normally do. Because I used to drink so much coffee, and uh, so I just steer clear. Has your body adjusted yet? Yeah, from, I mean, I mean you're always caffeine. tired. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> exactly. You're tired, but you okay. know, it's nice and you know, clean. All right. Well, I'm, I'll give you points for that one because okay. you guys have good. I mean, we have yeah, who's winning? On that yeah, one. yeah. You, you're both very well prepared for <laughs> the Wikipedia statistics. All right. Next up, uh, you cannot eat sushi. Phony or fact? <gasps> That's true. True. That is for true. Sure. True. Well, according to my sources, it says phony. Really? You can eat sushi except for shark, mackerel. You're not supposed to have any raw fish. fish. I don't yeah. know who you're talking to, Dr. Yeah, yeah, Christopher, yeah. here, but no that's a no-no. No raw fish, no raw meat. Uh, okay. No well, carpaccio, well, no yeah, deli yeah. meats. Carpaccio, okay. Well, Where'd we'll you get your info from? Well, I, I, Japanese I can't restaurant? share it. I, <laughs> it was from Kumo across the street. All right, so next up, the most popular boy's name is Ryan. <laughs> it's funny, but false. 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 She's a possible tree, so why not? Because I think we just talked about those popular baby names. Yesterday it was Liam, it was Jacob, Jacob. Leo? it was Noah. Liam. Those Liam. were the yeah. top Liam. three. Yeah, so there you go. Huh. Girls' names, do we have any ideas for that? Uh, How about Ryan works for a girl and a boy? Th that is good. Some movie star just named their, their baby Ryan, actually. Really? Yeah, this morning. Well, there's I heard Meg that. Ryan, but I, I No, no, Ryan, Ryan for a girl. For that's a cool. Person. Okay. Oh, oh, that's cool. That's hey, cool. that's <laughs> trendy. That's hot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's hot. We're hey, trending. Speaking of trending, <laughs> Teresa, coming up yes. next, we have celebrity fashion stylist Pilar Steinborn. She's going to be showing us some of the hottest sunglass trends. All right, and we'll be talking with the very funny Treehouse comedian Mitch Fatale. That's all coming up. Please welcome.